The French Parliament this week voted in favour of restoring works of art to the heirs of Jewish families despoiled by the Nazis during the Second World War. Thanks to the new law, 15 works of art kept in French public collections will finally be able to be returned to the family of their owner, including this painting in Paris by Marc Chagall. It was found by a Canadian who specialises in tracking down works of art and other objects looted by the Nazis. After years of investigation, he was able to prove that it had indeed been stolen. We accessed some information from Poland. We understood that there was a possibility that Mr. Sender had been despoiled. Um, you have a hunch, you have an idea, you have a theory, and um, those clues allowed us to reunite him <laughs> with the rest of his family. The painting was originally bought by David Sander, a Polish Jewish musician. Driven out of his apartment by the Nazis, he ended up in a Jewish ghetto before being deported to Auschwitz in 1942, where his wife and two-year-old daughter were murdered. He survived and reported the theft to the German government in 1962. We have an affidavit from Mr. David Sander, which does not name the painting, but describes it perfectly. The theft was soon perfectly established and recognized notably by the German courts, but also by the French government after our claim. The French government will return the painting to the five grand nephews and nieces of David Sander, who died in 1966. The return of this painting to the heirs does justice to David, the paintings, and those who remain alive in this family. After the war, the painting was taken from Poland and eventually bought by the artist himself and given to the Boburg Museum.